Okay, so I've decided to go back to using my uh, wonderful Pacuma uh, Messenger laptop bag for my 17 inch MacBook Pro. Um, what I thought I would do is possibly give you sort of a quick video tour. I have talked about it before in the blog, um, but I thought it'd be nice to give you sort of an insight into sort of some of the capacities and you know details of the bag itself. It really is a fantastic bag if you're looking to transport sort of tech goods and stuff between locations and it's kind of dependent on one of the podcasts i've been listening to recently uh mac power users there's not their last episode the one before that i think focused on sort of uh how they transport their mac uh to and from locations and stuff and they were talking about sort of storage capacities and protection systems and so on so the pacuma is pretty well known uh you've got the little pacuma logo down here at the front, uh, the Pacuma sort of badge and sign over here on the side. This is black with orange piping. Uh, you can get different color combinations. Um, the bag on the outside is fairly durable. This material is water resistant. Um, it's quite sort of strong and sturdy as well. Um, so you feel like your gear is pretty safe inside. Carry strap is again uh, stitched with a very high quality detail seal. Um, it's reinforced on both sides again for security purposes. Um, you can see that there. It's fairly well put together. Nice sturdy strap. The strap itself has a sort of um, shoulder support built in. So in other words, the, the weight of the bag can be sort of you know more comfortable when you're carrying it because it can hold quite a lot of stuff, and it needs to for me um, over the coming weeks. Um, take a look at the inside. Um, one of the things I really like about the Pacuma bags is that they actually are light on the inside. So you can see this is made of, you've got Velcro and uh, buckle fasteners on the inside of the top of the bag. Um, but the actual inside of the bag itself is light and clearly you can find anything you've got in there. Uh, it might seem like a small thing but if you are sort of you know trying to find a particular cable or plug or something like that you may have to struggle with other bags in terms of them being a little dark on the inside in terms of being able to see what's there so in this case it's quite easy to find sort of your stuff because the insides are a light grey colour um, again on the inside you've got sort of the Pacuma logo Pacuma logo even um, and this is one of the key sort of characteristics right here of the Pacuma system in terms of you have what they have termed their cocoon so let me see if I can get this open out for you a bit more and um, this is like an integrated sort of department or com compartment um, for sort of transporting your laptop and this is the K1 series so this one is basically designed for anything up to a 70 inch laptop or MacBook Pro in my case um, and they support both and you can see in there that's very very well padded and um, that's shock absorber type stuff it's water resistant and um, it feels very sturdy and it's integrated into the bag which makes it even sort of more robust um, so that bag closes over like that up the top you've got another compartment with loads of storage space for sort of cables and you know bits and pieces to do with your laptop in, in, in that sort of area there um, that's the cocoon. You've then got your main sort of storage compartment, um, which is sort of you know where you put possibly your files, your books, your external hard drive, um, possibly your codec ZI8 <laughs> as I'm holding. Um, you've got also little compartments here at the front uh, of the inside, which again there's loads and loads of little sort of areas that you can put stuff into um, in terms of holding and so on and so forth. Um, Outside of that, again, you have sort of the main front area of the bag, which has sort of two sort of main compartments. Um, these are the Velcro seals for the top of the bag. Inside that, you can hold sort of things like power cables and stuff. Um, my eye drops are in there at the minute. Um, possibly my glasses. Um, and then inside that, you've got another storage compartment, which holds sort of things like pens and pencils. Uh, you probably got a for um, your iPod. I know there's a special loophole here which basically allows you to feed the, the wire your earphones out through while keeping the iPod secure inside. There's a zip compartment if you had sort of money or sort of things like that that you wanted to hold off. Um, overall it's a very robust purchase. It looks pretty damn cool. I'm quite pleased with the visual style of it. Um, I think it's, uh, it's a very secure good way of actually holding things together. Outside two side pockets you've got another compartment here on the left hand side with a velcro closing 
probably put your lunch or your drink in there. And on the other side has sort of a, a, a non-closing compartment, sort of a Velcro tie over or clamp type thing that you can put maybe a drink probably better in that side. So overall it's a very complete, uh, loads of storage space, clean, secure, tidy. Um, presents itself very well as a, as a method of storage and altogether very usable. So that's the Bakuma K1, um, pretty much an awesome laptop bag, what I'll be using for my MacBook Pro. Uh, my Western Digital hard drive will go in there, uh, books, magazines, all my work stuff. Um, I'll try and get it packed up today, I'm ready for work for the week. Um, so if you're thinking of getting a laptop storage solution, I strongly suggest you check out the Bakuma range.